Hey guys, Joshua Gundamu here with another Gundam MSI review. And today I'm reviewing a custom Federation captured goof. A nice gray color all over. I didn't change the decal on him yet. Um, and I unfortunately won't be able to either. See, uh, I am currently dyeing this guy gray. And what you see before you is an effect of the vinegar in the mix. The vinegar, sometimes if it's too high, will bleach the plastic, and that which is good because that means you can get a darker plastic, a lighter color than normal. But uh, sometimes when you're dyeing it, it doesn't. It turns out really light like this, and so in four days he's going to turn a darker gray that has more of his natural blue color in it, which has been you know effectively chemically bleached at the moment. But it looks really cool, the beautiful gray that I wish I could keep. Uh, oxidization is what causes the color change. If you throw them in the freezer or keep them under water or stick plat uh, sticky putty on them, the parts that aren't exposed to the air um, will stay this color, which the freezing part still doesn't make much sense either. But who knows? It's one of the mysteries of the figures that I haven't been able to figure out. So I'm using watered down black dye on him and with some vinegar and yeah makes a very nice federation goof custom like they'd ever capture a goof custom intact you know it's too good to be true <laughs> well i hope you enjoyed the review see you guys next time